Let me get this correct. So Ani's basically gropes that girl and then invites her to come over to our place where she knows that she stole Yuffie's boyfriend. Not really. She didn't intentionally doing it, but this is going to get pretty awkward now. I think we're going to get a threesome. Not in that way, though. Let's begin the reaction. <laughs> this is awkward. Oh, hello. Um, um, a new friend? Bruh. Bruh. Oh, yeah, we know each other all right. But it's not her fault, right? I mean, it's just her subconscious power. Uh, <laughs> even, even the maid's like, I'm getting the fuck out of here. <laughs> uh, I think Yuffie will be more mature and be completely fine with it. That's the kind of character she is. See, look, if anything, she cares more about, like, how much it's affecting her. Like, she's too good. She's too good. You know what I just realized? Isn't she wearing the same outfit before? No, 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 no. The previous episode, she had a top on where her... You can see her booba is covered right now. Yeah? The dress just completely opened it. But this one, I think it's a different outfit. I should be focusing on the plot instead, though. But... Oh. 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 Friends? Friends? Damn. Damn. I wanted more of like a... <laughs> I wanted some spicy drama, but right now it's just... They're handling it too maturely. Everything's already resol like resolved. Oh. Vampires. Hmm. Yeah, what are you talking about? Wait, vampires? She's a vampire? She a vampire? バンパイアっていうかまあ、その She's, she's being a little bit nicer. It's not experimenting on a test rat, you know? It's it's we're training you. Yeah, that's what we're doing. What about her eyes? Whoa, they're more red-ish? Fangs? Vampire features? Whoa! She is a vampire after all. I mean, if you kinda look at Tilty's eye right now, it's the same similar color. I thought it was just the sunset. What? Okay, what can you do then? Vampires. I mean, the only vampires in the anime I know is like Dio from like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Is there anything I know? I, what, what was he good at? Stopping time? No, that's with the stand powers. They got like superhuman like strength and. What else? They get hit by sun. Don't they like die? I wonder if anything like that is consistent with her. Yuffie, what's wrong? Yuffie, what's wrong? I don't like that stare. What was that? What was that? Hmm. No, they're gonna talk alone. So what? Yeah, what was that look? What was that look? Hmm. You got some... You wanna start some shit? What's going on with you? Jealous that Anis was looking like that? Huh. So in her inherent jealousy from how Anis was looking at Tilty with such fascination, Yuffie just instinctively had that look of jealousy? Ooh, okay, okay, that just means that our bond is deepening. Uh, that's a good question. Assistant? No, 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 we're not really an assistant. We're more than that. We are... Not lovers. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. But yeah, I don't know. We're pretty good friends. Huh, it's almost as Tilty's kind of saying, hey, yo, figure out your identity. It's not a system anymore. You really want to be the Yuri couple? Go do it. Yeah. But maybe that's where Yuffie comes in. Maybe Yuffie will go along with that dream. Hmm, she's kind of telling her to get more serious about this. Wow, Tilty, you're so thoughtful. Thank you. Oh my goodness, I didn't know you cared that much about us. Who's there? 
Anis. Hello. Just want to see you late at night. We need to have a heart to heart and discuss. What am I? Am I just your assistant? Oh, dude, their slippers are matching too. Look at the colors. Oh, God. <laughs> the future. Our future. Our future. I wonder if Annie's just kind of like getting the hints. Oh, oh, she's moving. Oh, oh little, little much. Because she doesn't have it. Everybody wants what they don't have. At this rate, you know how Yuffie really almost like idolizes Annie's like ambition towards her goals no matter what? Yeah. Cause like she doesn't have <laughs> I want to fall in love like that too. <laughs> Hell yes! Come on, sleep over time. Sleep over time. But I was saying like, oh my god, I want a little bit of this though instead of instead of this. But I was just talking about how Yuffie doesn't seem to have any fixed goals of herself. But what if her goal is to just kind of accompany Anis's dreams? What? What you want to help out with with the chores? You gotta. You're just gonna flex your tits like that. What? Help. With. Help with what? Oh wait, she's sucking on. It is his butt. What? She been sucking on. Oh my god. Oh, my. dude, an impulse to drink blood, bro. This is the perfect excuse for even more Yuri fan service scenes. It's gonna be so intimate. Oh my god. Just show me. Show me. She can take the mana from other people's blood. You know, in like, in this show, she's saying the transfer of mana can be through blood, but in like, uh, for example, the Fate series. Wasn't the transfer of blood like literally through semen? So like, wasn't there like a scene with the, aren't like dolphins involved as like a meme? But like, but like, Osaka Rin, didn't she like do the suck? Is he one of the ministers of the arcane? Look at these pompous glasses. Where nothing wrong with glasses, but sometimes they're the ones that kind of goes like this and look very elitist, you know? Look at that monocle, man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, full name. <laughs> yeah! Oh my god, look at Tilty. Look at that. Oh my god. Tilty's design, it's so good. But yeah, it's a pretty cool crowd. Man, Tilty's veil. Look at Tilty's veil. Oh my god. Shady business. Sacrilege against the spirits. Yeah, they are definitely gonna oppose, like, you know how I kept saying magicology is gonna close the gap between people that can't use magic and the people that can? Obviously, the kind of group of people that's gonna gatekeep. These are exactly that faction of people that will do this. Can't even use magic. Bro, have you seen her Excalibur? Could you imagine these fucks? Yeah, actually, this council of boomers, man. Oh, Yuffie, come on, show them up. I can't get over this guy's monocle. <laughs> oh. mm. <gasps> the genius prince. <laughs> so because we have a genius magician princess on our side advocating for magicology, that does have more weight to everything that Annie says. Mm. Oh my god, look at Tilty though. Look at Tilty though. Oh I should focus on what she said, but look at Tilty though. True. Closes the gap. Everybody can fly now. Isn't that such a great thing? But would they be willing for that? Would, would they want the commerce to be also be able to fly or use magic? I don't think so. Usually the people in power want to keep that power and not let anyone in. That's just human nature. <laughs> just a little bit problematic in safety. We crashed so many times, come on. More versatile magic tool. Oh. Oh, wait, wait, what is this? Huh? Is this an airplane? Bro! Is she... 
This is this is an airplane, bro. What? I wonder how much of this is inspired from her, honestly, like her previous life back on Earth, which I'm assuming where she's been reincarnated from. Bro, that's insane, though. This is actually like alien technology to them. Well, who were the people that invented the airplane here? IRL? Wasn't it like the Wright brothers or something? I forget, but this is insane. Bro. Bro, we're gonna cook and make an airplane? That's a very good excuse. Now they can't take it. They want this kind of innovation. Mr. Monocle and Mr. Glass is here. <laughs> Come on. It's so practical. Fuck the ancient faith and the spirit. Move on with the modern society. Amazing. Where's the claps? My Yuffie. Sacrilege. Okay, that okay, she's gonna bring up that point too. But yeah, okay, okay. But here, let's address it. But he's gotta have a winning condition here. There's no reason that she wouldn't like bring this up if she didn't have a good counter. Oh, say it. Shut them down. Oh, the soundtrack suddenly played. You know she's about to shut them down. Mm, talk your shit. That's right. No disrespect. She's cooking. She's cooking. Ooh, it's actually respect for the spirits. Nice narrative. They kept saying it's heretics, sacrilege, but no, 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 no. We're actually doing this for tradition. Man, she should just be a politician. The way that she talks, she just turned the most, like, the argument of how this is sacrilege just pivoted 180. It's actually respecting the spirits. This is amazing. She's so good at talking. Now everybody's on board. And even the people that can't be on board, their win condition of this is disrespectful doesn't work anymore. Completely nullified that. Genius. Truly genius princess. Wow. wow. Amazing! Oh wow, they're actually clapping for her on like Anis's introduction. <laughs> Come on, show me the face of Mr. Monocle and glasses. They're probably going like Oh Yuffie, look at how Anis is looking at you! Not only do we have vampires in this series, then we're gonna get airplanes and Yuffie is so good that Anis calls her my Yuffie. Oh, my heart. This is getting too good. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists on my channel for even more content. And until next time, take care.